Um, what do you mean is that hater? It's not it. Yes, sir. Say out of YouTube. Look at this shit. Look, 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 look. look. They're definitely disliking this video. Yeah, yeah. Get a life, no doubt get about a that. Life. <laughs> yeah, he did. Well, whatever yeah, both NECA yeah. is a fucking loser. <laughs> Yo, NECA. NECA. Oh, I did. Hi. Hi, NECA. <laughs> Hello. We love you, NECA. Psych, <laughs> 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 yeah. I hope NECA burns in hell. No, what? Bro. All right, boys, as you guys can see, we are back on Call of Duty Vanguard today. But today's video is actually going to be different than normal because I'm not going to be trickshotting like I normally do. Instead, today, I'm going to be going crazy with the most broken gun in Vanguard and potentially one of the most broken guns in Call of Duty history ever. Now, there's a lot of broken guns in this game. There's an STG, there's an MP40, there's a combat shotgun. But today, I present to you guys the Gracie Auto. Basically, just think of the broken combat shotgun, but with gung-ho so you can run while you're shooting it, and it's semi-auto, not like pump back. Oh, yeah, and I glitched my class to have two of them, so I'm basically unstoppable. If you guys interested in using this loadout i'm gonna be putting the class setup i'm using with all the attachments and all that at the end of the video i highly suggest you guys try it out before it gets nerfed again and you guys should have some pretty similar results because as you guys heard in the intro clip this class setup does tend to get people just a tad bit upset not only is this video filled with more rage reactions like that but i got a bunch of crazy clips as well like six ons and stuff like that not only that but i actually ended up dropping a nuke or a v2 rocket as well so if you guys do enjoy this video please make sure to drop a like rating on it and also leave a comment in the comment section below let me know if you guys like this new editing style not all of my videos are going to be like this but hey i'm always willing to try new things so let me know what you guys think oh yeah one last thing all this footage was actually taken from dos house 24 7 i know shipments out now and they have like a ship house 24 7 mode and this loadout would actually go even crazy on shipment so if you guys enjoy this video and want to see a part two let me know all right guys without further ado let's get into the action the what hello yeah, what? Oh shit. You guys still use shotguns and you fucking lose. You guys are ass. We still use shotguns. We literally started using them last night. Ass. I just started tonight. When's the last time you got pussy, bitch? Oh, shit. Fuck. Oh, shit. 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 Oh, shit.
okay, okay. Oh. I need to mute these kids. I want them to react funny though. Oh shit, okay, okay. Ah. Oh. Kill chain, okay. Let me go off again. Okay, a little five on with the doggy. Oh, it would have been a six. Go off, dog. Another kill chain? Doing my thing. There is another kill chain. I'm surprised your teammate didn't drop on me too. Me too, man. Since this guy's actually hacked, probably dropped like a few VT rockets. There's no way he's gonna get anything. Long PC, 151. Yeah. 151. Dude, I went off. The accusation. So I can't believe it. Cheater. Did you hear like in the background? I know he's cheating. He's got your shit. NECA! NECA! I played What'd you say, NECA? Like... Oh, I wish I had a mic. I think I told this kid to send to my shotgun. YouTube. The biggie kid. NECA. NECA. Oh, I did. Hi. Hi, <laughs> NECA. Hello. We love you, NECA. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Psych, I hope NECA burns in hell. No, what? I think that dog, man. Patch this. It is broken. But let me do my thing first. Oh, let me go. Let me go. Aww. Yeah, I need to level up my double yeah, barrel next. Oh, cool play, dude. Yeah, <laughs> awesome. T8. Fucking just almost 170 on him. Oh my god! <laughs> you can't believe it. Yeah, he had the, he had that perk on the fucking yeah. Say it. I know you wanna gung ho. What's that perk called, Eternal? You know gung what it's called. Yup. Yeah, gung ho. Yeah, that is overpowered as fuck. I wish I hadn't known about that when I was doing that shotgun, but L. actually, I haven't done that shotgun yet, so that's what I'll be putting on. W. Yep. 142 multi kills. All right, everyone. So I've already shown you the absolute carnage that this class can cause, but I haven't shown you the actual class yet. So as you guys can see, I actually have two of the same shotgun, which you normally can't do with overkill, which is my third perk. As you guys can see, if I click in here, it says this gun is locked. I can't put on the same one, but there's actually a glitch to be able to do that. I don't have my own tutorial, but it's a really easy glitch. So I'll find a tutorial on YouTube and link it in the description below. You guys will be able to get it no problem. The only thing with this glitch is you can't actually have the same 10 attachments on both guns. So I have nine of the same attachments and only one is different. Let's get into those now. Alright guys, so for the muzzle, I use the M97 full choke. For the barrel, I use the chariot. We're gonna skip the optic for now. For the stock, I use the ragdoll p-wire. For the proficiency, I use gung-ho. For the kit, I use quick. The rare grip is fabric grip. The magazine is the 12 gauge 10 round drum. The ammo type is buck and slug. And the underbarrel is the SMLE or smile pistol grip. These attachments all help with stuff like sprint to fire speed, moving speed, and hip fire accuracy because you're going to be doing a lot of running and gunning and just emptying your clip out. Like that's what gung ho is for, fire while sprinting, and then the magazine, the 10 round drum, so you can just shoot a full 10 round, switch over to your other gun, shoot another 10 bullets without reloading. You have quick on for faster sprint speed as well. The most important thing about this loadout though is the sprint to fire speed, so you're going to want all the attachments for that, like the ragdoll P wire stock and also the uh, smile or SMLE pistol grip. However, the most important attachments are the barrel. This is what gives it the damage range and makes it be able to beam people from that far. And the ammo type, the buck and slug. This actually gives it a slug instead of uh, the buckshot pellets, which allows you to do way more damage at way more range. Combining that with the barrel, you're basically unstoppable. With gung-ho and quick while you're running at them with sprint to fire speed, all these attachments combined make for a lethal class loadout. The only thing I actually have different about my primary and my secondary is the optic I use on them. I just use a really small optic this out of the way because I don't do much aiming in with this class anyway. As far as perks go, I either use fortified or survival training for my perk one, depends if they're stunning or using grenades more. For perk two, always forward intel. If you guys don't know, this is like the most overpowered perk in the game. You can literally tell where enemies spawn by looking at a diamond on your minimap. And then for this class, you need perk three overkill. It's necessary for the glitch, so yeah, you can't really change that or else I'd be using lightweight or double time. Then for my lethal, this one doesn't matter. I use thermite or uh, throw a knife if I want to knife people. 
And then for my tactical, I use stem to refresh tactical sprint so I can move at them faster. And that's going to be a wrap in today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And to anyone who's new to my channel, I hope you enjoyed the video enough to consider subscribing with post notifications on. If you guys are wondering on how you can stay more connected or up to date with me, I'm going to be leaving all my links down below in the description. That's going to include my Twitter, which I'm active on so much daily. So make sure to go follow me over there if you don't yet. My Discord, my Twitch, my second channel, my TikTok. I'm active on all of them pretty regularly. So if you do enjoy my content and want to stay connected, please make sure to go check them out and show some love. Oh yeah, one last thing. Anyone who's new to my channel that might want to know more about me personally and not just like my clips, I will be doing a Q&A soon for you guys over on Twitter. So make sure to go follow me over there, like I said, if you haven't yet. But if you just have a quick question you want a quick answer to, I do try to read every single message in my Twitch chat and reply to it. So if you ever see me live, come stop by my chat, ask a question, and I'll answer to the best of my abilities. But yeah, I'll catch you guys tomorrow with another banger upload. Peace out, everyone. Parallel neck out.